Hi guys, it's Jess from Mom For Real, and today I want to talk to you about creating your own Pinterest board. Now, this board could be any kind of board, but I want to talk specifically about a board that you can create to save some of the projects that I do on Mom For Real, like my cleaning packs. If you don't have a Pinterest account already, you would have to go to Pinterest.com and create one. It's super easy, and it's a great place to save all of those things that you see around the Internet that you love and would like to reference later. I use it to save cleaning tips, DIY and craft ideas, and recipes also. But the way I'm trying to explain this to you is that you can create a board that references all of my tips so that you can easily access them from your computer or your phone or virtually anywhere you are that you have internet access. So let me show you how to create a Pinterest board. First, you go to the first square at the top of your Pinterest account. There's a little plus sign in the middle and it says create a board. You click that plus. This is where you can name your board. We're going to name this board Mom for Real. Oh, let's fix that. Real Cleaning Hacks. Now we want to give the board a description. I'm going to say Cleaning Hacks and Tricks from Jess at Mom for Real. What kind of board is it? This is where you specify exactly what kind of board it is. Since most of, most of my um, cleaning hacks are DIY oriented, I'm going to go with DIY and crafts. It just is a better fit for what I do because a lot of the things I share are DIY or homemade cleaning solutions like granite cleaner or countertop cleaner or toilet bombs that you can use to clean your toilet, but you make yourself. So I like the DIY here. Now there's a place to add a map. I don't ever do that. I'm not really sure what it does. And there's a place where you can make your board secret or public. I leave mine public so that if anybody else who follows me on Pinterest likes my ideas or the ideas that I'm pinning, they can see them and pin them as well. Might as well share the love. Now if you want to make it secret, you definitely can here by clicking this and that way, nobody else can see what you're pinning. This is a great way, like if you want to make a wedding board and you don't want everybody to see your ideas, you can make it secret, and so you can only see that. Here in the collaborator section, you can decide if you want to share this board with somebody else. So for me, I'm going to keep this private um, because all of my followers can already see it, but if you like cleaning tips and you think, well, my mom also likes cleaning tips or my sister would love these, you can add them to the board using the email that they signed up um, on Pinterest with. So this would just be a way to share exactly what's on that board, and that would mean that that person could also pin to this board. Thank you so much for following along. You can create your board by hitting create, and I hope this was helpful for you.